It's not dope. And we don't know. All right, so it's gonna be Stock Taker versus Lemon Tea. Right. Power Wolf. This is a a classic in terms of characters, but I don't see Lemon Tea coming after Zeno very much. Yeah, no, those Jersey boys. Yeah. Hard to hard to wrangle them over here, you know. I wish they had told me they were carpooling, because I took the train. <laughs> That's all right. Up for fair. Oh no, Lemon Tea. Right. Oh no. That's unfortunate. I mean, I didn't see what he... What oh, he this went is Winter's Quarters. Ooh, okay. Is this Quarters... Is this means it's a, is it top 24, or is it, like, still... Well, this is actual Winter's Quarters. It's actual Winter's Quarters. Yes. Okay. Wait, wait, tap this bracket so I can keep up with it in real time. Meanwhile, Stockdaker is showing no mercy, even with that SD at such an early percent. He's he's saying, you know, this is a, this is a competitive game, and I'm here to win. Yeah, it is. okay. The winner, this, the winner of this will be going into top eight, which is the options. I love it. I love that upbeat. Because, and I like that just, I want to see that more from a lot of wolf players. Like, as he tries to snipe the jump there with the wolf flash. Like that upbeat out of shield, since a lot of times, a lot of people, a lot of uh, characters can land on your shield with a spot dodge. And again, the, the invincible back air beating out, the, uh, beating out that wolf flash. Because a lot of times when people are landing on shield with spot dodge, Getting the upbeat out of shield with such a delay and then a charging hitbox, that is extremely powerful. <laughs> this back air is completely safe. Good, good job on Lemon T for knowing the matchup, knowing what he can and can't challenge, especially when he's in the corner when everything really does matter. Oh, okay. He didn't cross up with the down air. That was why. Oh. Hello, so sorry about the quick little interruption in my commentary. Thank you so much to UBL for holding it down. In the meantime, and we're only two minutes in, and Stockseeker is down to his last stop. Yeah, he SD'd at like 20. Ah. Uh, <laughs> which was unfortunate to say the least. Yeah. But he's. It and seems like he's keeping composed and using this game. He's like, I'm trying to see what I can and can't connect, actually, what'll work and what doesn't. I think I lied because I think Stockseeker is the Palu. No, Stock Taker is the Palu right now, and, and uh, Lemon T is the Wolf. Oh my god, I because got Stock I see is the, the Palu? Yeah. Okay, got it, my bad. You all good. Yeah, yeah Stock Taker is the Palu. Yeah, okay, so so I was just like wondering what was happening, because I saw the tag T.O. over the Wolf, and SSS yeah, over the Palu. Right but anyhow, right now, the back air trading with the laser. Right now, Wolf has to come back. Um, Stock Taker missing the two-frame option, which would have converted to back air, but able to get it anyways. Oh, it's best of five. Ooh. We see, B, we see BB's hand with a five. Yeah, so five top dollar. twelve is best of five. Okay, I guess we have the time for that. I'm about it. That's how we do, baby. Um. Okay. Anyhow, I think they're gonna get right back to PS2. Yeah. Not, not really sure what happened in the first game, so you can speak on that a little bit more. Yeah, it was a lot of just like Lemonty's. Lemonty wants to jump. Yep. Lemonty, Lemonty is a jump player. He is trying to hit that jump button and hit hit his aerials. Uh, he plays both Wolf and Fox, yep. so characters that have. Uh, Spacey's phenomenal aerials, that's just kind of their thing. Yep. So, the problem when he comes to playing Palutena is she has the she has a aerial that beats every other aerial in her back air. So yep. she just decided, especially whenever he would, uh, Stock Taker would put Lemon T in the corner, it's like, you're going to have to find a way around me hitting back air where you are right now. And right now, already, like, Stock Taker has all the stage control he wants. He's going to get a very comfortable 30% lead, but that's going to be closed in by the tech chase. From Lemon T. I love the fact that he went through the down smash. It's a very high commitment, high reward move, and was able to get rewarded for it. Controlling all of stage right now. Stock Taker armoring through whatever Lemon T might have inputted there with the dash attack. Of course, on dash attack, and I'm backing on Palutena, whose shield is completely intangible or invulnerable. In the second, mixing up the two. Um, um, invulnerable. Invulnerable. Because intangible would mean it couldn't be hit. Okay. Um. We are right now both of them are like scrambling around trying to hit each other. T uh, Lemon T trying to catch a landing with the back air but unable to do so. Right, just a dash attack to power and knowing that like, Lemon T is probably going for either a down tilt or an F tilt to, after such an F smash. And it's usually the wolf mix and the, that's some wolf mix right there. It's his, uh, the angled down wolf flash catching the standing Palutena. And right now. Uh, Stock Taker can't really do anything. You can do back throw, a forward air, just gonna knock him off. Uh, Ooh, tries to catch a normal, get up, get up a cycle with the down tilt. But of course, that is not going to connect in the back throw more than enough to 
take it out. Ducks take a 42%. A good lead. I love the edge cancel up B. Just a little bit a little bit stylish, but mostly just like really, really throw off the limit the timing. And just like that, Stock Taker has taken the momentum of the game to himself with the percent lead, the positional lead. Wolf has to find a way to land on and found a way to do it. Stock Taker overcommitted to that option by jumping onto the platform. What I love to see here coming out from coming out from Stock Taker is how he's just so determined on to play play it right outside of Lemon T's range. He's playing like a phenomenal dash back game and a dash up game. Oh, he just missed. The... I'd be not getting yeah. to ledge. It's really, really unfortunate. It was angled up, so you know he he was trying to go for that spacing. That wasn't it wasn't so much a mispositioning, but just a little bit. Yep. A little bit off in in, in, uh, in eyeballing it, I guess. Oh yeah, but right now, uh, Saktiku, oh. ooh, the high recovery, definitely feeling off Lemon T. He might have been able to react to that, but again, it's like one of those things that you can only react to if it's a primed reaction, right? So you have to actively expect that to then be able to react and punish to it. Um, and right now, Saktiku looks like he's maybe going to run away with this game, but I love the commitment. Yeah, that auto radical was... Uh he was expecting Lemon T to commit to the ledge trapping, and, but after the exchange on the last ledge where he uh, where he realized that Lemon, uh, Stock Taker was teleporting on these, these precise, yeah. on these really precise angles, especially since you cannot two-frame the teleport coming from above yeah. the ledge. So it's like, well, let me just hit you if you're just going to go that high up. I have the jump height to do it. Getting a little something started with that forward and into nail. And right now, ah, not that getting the whip punish. I think that he was, was afraid to run into the auto radical, but he wasn't aware of the fact that it shot over his head. So that's really, really unfortunate that he missed out on that opportunity to punish it properly. Landing back, uh, knocking off Wool significantly. And the F tilt still not enough to take it quite yet. And long, long lasting enough to where it w it would hit even if he if it would hit the neutral getup even if he hold, held yep. shield because the active hitbox would would definitely catch that one frame with the downer that's a very very interesting option but ah uh, almost getting the down tilt into up air. and right now stock needs can do anything he can do yep dash attack not enough to take it quite yet yeah, that's really crush. surprising yes. that, new, that neutral air dodge uh, pretty pretty telegraphed with a fa fall speed as fast as wolf. Uh, you see that a lot with other characters like uh, Fox yep. and uh, Wario, who just have phenomenal airspeed. They want to abuse the fact that neutral air dodge has zero yep. lag. So, and Lemon T has never really been committing to like landing or neutral getuping and holding shield. He's trying to not get stuck in shield, which is a, a fair thing. You don't yep. really want to have that happen. So, Stock Taker knows that if you're not going to shield, then this back air is uh, coming for you. Um, right now, going into game three, the momentum is definitely in Stock Taker's like, favor right now, so Lemon T is going to have to maybe slow it down a little bit. I feel like he's losing. I, I love the way he's mixing his recovery. He's losing his stock a little bit earlier to those like unfortunate uh, SDs, uh, as you mentioned before. Right now, like Stock Taker getting a very, very cool 38%. Right now, oh, those great catches on the cross up with the dash attack. Down tilt, knocking him yeah, away. That'll do it. <laughs> F smash. Stock Taker, so well versed in the Wolf matchup, playing Wolf himself, knowing exactly the distance that F smash would cover because he was right there. He was almost on the edge of getting through it. But Stock Taker, that was beautiful. That was beautiful spacing. Those wings don't have a sour spot either, mm -hmm. which is uh, something. It's it something, is something, yeah. <laughs> You're telling me an incredibly disjointed move doesn't have bad, like, doesn't, like, punish you through bad spacing? That's crazy. That's but crazy, bro. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Coming down here, Stock Taker feels, it feels like Stock Taker has uh, adapted to the to the counter adaptations. And yeah, I'm Lemon surprised has... he up B above the stage like that. That was yeah. brilliant. What I can see a lot with Lemon T is, like, I feel like he might have a regressed a little bit in his adaptation, going back to more of his bread and butter, bread and butters to try and hold, uh, to try and make sure his gameplay is a, li a little bit more steady. Meanwhile, Stock Taker has already adapted to this. Yeah. So, like, he's, he's able to punish, he's able to punish a lot harder and a lot more consistently. Oh, he fell out of the mirror. But still able to land the upper and at 148% more than enough to take it. The back here, I back stock here taker laughing enough. He knows that his DI on that was a little bit suboptimal, but that's okay because he's still sitting at a stock lead. But who knows how long that'll last. Getting the lead on the neutral early dodge down. Oh, I, oh, the spot the dodge. Yeah, the spot dodge. Uh, but still missing the tomahawk grab there. 
Um, right now he's just perpetuating his advantage here as long as he can, but Stocks could quickly turn and get around with that dash attack. The problem with Wolf is that when, when, once the percent start climbing, a lot of your combo start, uh, a lot of your combo and momentum starters start sending too far for Wolf to catch up with it. So he's going to rely a lot more on tomahawking and a lot more on just spatial pressure with how safe his smash attacks can be in order to in order to put, put opponents in positions where uh, they can be punished. Oh, just going up with the jab, jab, dash back, dash forward. I love forward, the fact that a bit earlier, uh, when you see Lamenti committing to a back air off stage, which is a very aggressive option, but considering that he is a stock down, it is something that he absolutely had to do. And right now, stock ticker looks like he might run away with the set with a 3-0, oh, but Lamenti making sure to hold his ground as long as he can. But That's a really good explosive flame. That's, yep. a, that's a Gon's explosive flame. Yep. <laughs> What can I say? That was just really brilliant play from Stock Ticker. I feel like yeah. Game 2 could have definitely been his. G definitely could have been belonging to Lemon T had he not unfortunately lost his stock.